All right, so the big question of this video is how many pairs you should trade when you're just starting out. So we're coming right back, stay tuned. All right, so you make a decision in your life. You wanna be a trader. However, you're just starting out. So the only thing you've done so far is you logged into YouTube, Instagram, uh, what is it, Facebook, Twitter, you started following, subscribing to all of these different channels, following people and all that cool stuff that everybody is doing. You got, you got engaging in the community of traders and you've seen a lot of people posting a uh, bunch of screens, like they have six, six screens, four screens, three screens. I even have, I even have three screens, and they're following and trading so many pairs, then so many stocks that it's it's confusing. You don't know what they're doing, and you're thinking that's the secret of their success. So naturally, you want to start trading immediately because you feel that rush. You want to get rich quick. Uh, you want to you want to start trading immediately with as many pairs as possible stop no don't rush it's not going to lead you into good direction yeah eventually you will add more and more pairs but the big question on this video is how many pairs you should start with one pair just one freaking pair because look when you're born you're not starting your life as a teenager you start with in your first year Right, you have zero, you're zero years old and you're just starting out. <laughs> so it's your, in your first year of life, you learn the ropes of training. That's, that's how it is uh, with, with trading basically. You get your first pair out, you start testing on that first pair and then eventually, you know, that grows on you. You develop a lot of strategies for that one pair and then you go ahead and start testing those same strategies on different pairs and then you start noticing stuff like, not all strategies work on all of the pairs, which when you're first starting out, you're thinking, wow, well, if you let's say that you're testing a trend strategy, so some kind of RSI candle goes overbought and you sell. And it's in, it's in the direction of a trend and it works on a pound dollar, for example. However, you take the same strategy same time frame and you say okay i'm making thousand pips per month that's what social media stuff tells you to believe they they lure you to believe that you can make thousand pips per month just by trading one pair and uh it's sustainable you can make a lot of money millions of dollars by lambos okay i'm going in the wrong direction am i okay forget about it yeah but you you, you take the same strategy to a different pair and now you can see that uh-uh no way, Jose, it's not gonna happen. That same strategy is not gonna work on a different pair. Chances are. Sure, there are strategies that can work on the different pairs as well. I'm trading six pair portfolio currently. It's my third year of trading. And I can tell you that not all of the strategies that I'm trading are working on all of the pairs. On some pairs, I'm not taking first strategy. And on some pairs, I'm not taking second strategy, but I'm taking the first one. And so back and forth. So that's why I'm recommending you to start with just one pair, just one stock. Learn how to trade, learn the ropes of trading, learn the terminology of trading, learn how to how, learn yourself, on, learn about yourself on your first pair. You know, that's nothing bad. There is nothing bad about it because if you approach to trading with the rich, get rich quick mindset, you will blow in quite a few accounts and you will be out of business fairly quickly. And if you approach the trading as a business, then you have a good chance of standing here, staying here for a long, longer period of time. But you gotta understand that trading is just like any business and it will take you a while to get good. It will take you a while to, you know, to get, to build that payer portfolio, to build that diversity in pairs so that you also can have multiple monitors so that you also can follow like eight, seven, ten pairs and make hundreds of thousands of pips. Ah, not going to happen hundreds of thousands now, nah. but thousands of pips. Yeah, they can, it can fairly happen. Uh, I'm actually looking at uh, my trading portfolio uh, where, I be able, where I'll be able to make 4,000 pips per year. And I'll be extremely happy because it, it will mean that I will be able to make around 40% return year on year basis and which will compound into significant returns in a longer period of time. So 
yeah, basically that's a small rant right there uh, and a big lesson. Listen, start with just one pair. Start with just one pair. Go test one strategy on it. You know, create a strategy. If you don't know how to create a forex trading strategy or a stock trading strategy, I'll link a video above. I think your top right corner will have that video on. So click on it, check out how to create a strategy, but start with a single pair. That's all you need. You don't need anything else. Forget about social media. Forget about six screens, seven screens, eight screens, a bunch of screens. Just forget about it. It's not what you need to start trading. You just need single strategy, one pair, and a lot of work. And with that being said, if you like this kind of video, do this on a daily basis. Well, this kind of educational videos I do two, three times per week, but on a daily basis I do forex market analysis where I show you the trades that I took on my pair portfolio. I show you my equity curve and what I've learned. So if you're interested in this, this kind of stuff and this kind of content, please consider subscribing on this channel if you're new here. Also comment below if you have any questions, if you disagree with something that I said, that's absolutely fine. Also make sure to click that like, vid, vid, uh, like button and share the video. Thank you very much for watching and speak to you soon. Bye bye.